TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials down 210, Nasdaq's off 135, S&P's off 43, gold contract down $9, trading at 12.58 an ounce. You get silver down 17 cents, $14.69 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 47 cents, $45.31 a barrel. Notes and bonds are flat. You get the 10-year note. 121.01, 30-year bond, 144.26. The 10, the 30-year bond, folks, is an ABC structure up. Took out the B point yesterday, has the volume behind the move, 147 coming at us. Notes, bonds, higher price, lower yield. King dollar, King dollar's up 717 ticks, trading 96,445. What you had with King dollar, King dollar came down yesterday with conviction, wide price spread, accelerated volume, broke its August 15th swing high that it had been taken out in the market. It's been fighting about in a huge way. What you have out here today, you're up 717 ticks. You get 16,000. The setup, folks, is lower price. In fact, if you're a Joe DiNapoli fan, this is a railroad track. And uh, bottom line, it's going to be interesting to see how this uh, baby uh, shakes out, Fibonacci-wise. Bottom line, I expect what you're going to build cause once again, get back inside the 95, 830 number. Uh, that number, the market has been battling about in a huge way. Euro out here, Euro is trading at a price point of 113.69 to 1 US dollar. The yen is at 111.30 to 1 US dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&P. What you have is this. We have five trading days left after today, including New Year's Eve and Christmas Eve. Bottom line, you're barreling lower. You get volume. You're at 243 right now on this SPY. Your ABC structure down is 241. NDX 100, the composite actually, the composite is just ripped apart. It's high volume low from the February 9th time frame. And with that setting up, folks, we are going down to the November 2016 level. In fact, if you go to the small caps, you're going to see small caps are already into that area. That is one big number, folks, because the bottom line, it took two years to get up into these numbers. It looks like it's going to take four months to get back into that area. And in the NASDAQ, that is one nasty number because when you start talking about the NASDAQ, you're talking about down to 5,200. Right now, you're at 6,300. But bottom line is that we've come off a high of 8,100. NASDAQ is already into a bear market. You're down over 20% in the NASDAQ. Stay right there, folks. Next 60 minutes of trading coming up next, and you can expect high volatility in this market as we come into the close today. Coming right back, folks.